Okay, I'm going to show you guys how to transfer all of your old iTunes, um, including the metadata, into a brand new Mac. So first you're going to make sure that your external hard drive is connected, or your USB or whatever it may be. And then you're going to go to Go and then Home. That's to um, find all of your old iTunes. You're going to go Home, and you're going to go into your music. and then your iTunes. So that's all of your old iTunes music as as well as the metadata for the play counts and the ratings. So we're going to open a new window and we're going to go back into the hard drive and what you're going to do is just simply copy all of your old iTunes library into your external hard drive. And that's going to take a while. I got quite a bit of songs here. So, as that's loading, we'll just show you in that iTunes folder, it contains all of your album artwork, your metadata with your, your play count, um, any ratings that you might have had in your old iTunes library. So, we're going to let that transfer, and then we're going to plug it into the new MacBook or your new computer. Okay, so now we're on uh, the brand new Mac, the brand new computer, and when you first open iTunes for the very first time, you're going to have nothing in there, so that's what it's going to look like. So we're going to make sure that we quit iTunes. You have to quit iTunes to make sure this works. So we're going to go back into our external hard drive, and there is our iTunes folder that we copied from the old Mac. We're going to go ahead and open a new window here. And again, just like last time in the old Mac, we're going to go go and then to home. And then you're going to go into your music music folder. And this is your, your empty folder of music on the new MacBook. So we're going to go ahead and we're just going to throw that out. Nothing was in there, so we're gonna make sure we empty the trash on that. Empty trash. And we're simply just gonna bring our old iTunes folder from the external hard drive and it's simply just gonna copy it into the music folder of the new Mac. So we're just gonna wait for that to transfer. Okay, done transferring, so all we gotta do is close all those windows off, and we're gonna go back into iTunes, open it up, and boom, there is all of your music. It's all there with previous ratings, any likes, and also your play count is there as long as well as all of your dates that you added the music at. There you have it, there's all your music. Um, if that unfortunately didn't work, you're just going to have to go into advanced settings and select um, the, f the source of where your, your iTunes music was. So it shouldn't be too hard to find, it should just be in um, under the music and then iTunes media and that should be it.